So another thing we can do with OneNote is that we can record audio and video. If we go to insert, I can insert an audio recording or a video recording straight into the OneNote page by selecting either of these. Now I'm going to go for record audio and you can see that in this wee symbol here has appeared. So it tells me that the audio video is recording, it gives you the time that your recording started and the dates and you can see that a new tab has opened up at the top, a recording tab. So in here you can either pause your recording or you can stop it altogether. So I'm going to stop my recording there and then I can also move it about the page. So if I wanted to put it next to something else on the page, I can drag and drop it. And to listen to it back, you just double click um, and it will let you hear the recording or you can go back to playback and do um, play or see playback. If you're not happy with your recording and you think you want to do it again, you can just simply click on this here and then select delete and it will remove your recording from that page. Um, now for students, only your teacher and yourself will be able to see the recording. Other students will not be able to see your recording unless you were to put it in the collaboration space, which we won't be doing.